Steve, over the course of the, the last year or so, we've been talking to a couple of folks on Facebook who told us we needed to take a look at a product called Glance Ephus. Now, uh, this is the first chance we've had to see it in, in its native format. If you would, tell us a little bit about the device and more important, what market it's destined for and what you're doing with it here. Okay, this is a non-certified product, uh, so it's for experimental, light sport, and ultralight. Um, the, uh, the unit gives you navigation, a GPS GLONASS. It gives you AHARS, which is active attitude indicator. And you also get a basic four-cylinder engine monitor, like for a Rotax. Now, all the components we see here, is this a standard installation? This is actually an augmented installation. You would normally get, for the basic price, you would get one display, the AHARS, and the basic engine monitor. You can certainly add another display to see two sets of data at the same time. You could add three. Uh, they're networked together, so they all, um, they all share the same data. So it's data redundancy. If you were to lose one, you can see the data on e either of the others. And I would assume there's a reversionary mode that allows you to kind of compact all data into one if uh, one takes a dive? Oh, they share all the data, so this, it's live all the time, so it's no problem. What's the panel depth required for something like this? I believe this is uh, like one and a half inches. It's not much. And pricing? Pricing is, uh, our show price is $23.50 for one display, AHARS, and the basic engine monitor. Run me through the functionality of the Glance Cephas one. Okay, so basically you have several displays that you can pick from. This is an attitude indicator. As we talked about, we have an active AHARS. You can select multiple displays. They have the ability to show air spaces. There's a composite display with some engine data or there's engine monitoring by itself. It's quite flexible as far as how the data is displayed and when it's displayed and so forth. Is there a rate limit or such on the AHARS? Or can, uh, for instance, can you do basic aerobatics with it or not? Uh, there, actually, there is an aerobatic team that has chosen this, this system to be their standard EFIS. Well, this is the first time we've seen it here in the States. What's the overall availability to the U.S. market? We stock these here in the United States, and they're readily available, so uh, we can ship on a moment's notice. What's the service and support policy? We support here in the United States, and uh, if there's a problem, we would service basic items, and then any complex items would go back to the manufacturer. Tell me a little bit about the manufacturer. Uh, the manufacturer's in Czech Republic. Uh, they've been around for a while. Uh, they have several interesting products. They just released a HUD, which looks very good. When's the HUD supposed to be available? I believe it's available now. Aero TV is brought to you by Progressive Aerodyne C-Ray Elite offers turbocharged Rotax Power and Garmin G3X Touch Avionics. Incredibly well equipped, you can fly away in this best in category Amphib for less than $160,000. Visit C-Ray.com for more details. Concorde's recombinant gas RG series sealed battery technology produces a high performance battery with the advantages of being pre-tested and fully charged at the factory. Find out more about Concorde's entire line of batteries at www.concordbattery.com. Concorde, the heart of your aircraft.